The Center for Computational Sciences, or CCS for short, was established to provide a cooperative research field where the computational scientists and the computer scientists work together for state-of-the-art scientific problems by advanced co-designing. We have eight research divisions on particle physics, astrophysics, nuclear physics, quantum condensed matter physics, life science, global environmental science, high-performance computing systems, and computational informatics, supported by more than 40 of faculty members. The CCS is the predecessor of the Center for Computational Physics, which was established in 1992 and has been contributed greatly to the development of research in computational physics. In the division of quantum condensed matter physics, we develop first principles computational methods and software to explore motions of electrons and ions in atomic scale that are important in both fundamental science and industrial applications. In the field of optical science, we develop an open source software, SAMON, that is based on first principles time-dependent density functional theory. It has made great contribution in attosecond science to uncover ultra-fast electronic motion inside materials induced by laser pulses. Besides, we also developed a simulation technique called the ESM method in electrochemistry. We can simulate electrochemical reactions at the interface between the electrodes and the electrolyte with unprecedented accuracy. We are conducting joint research with many industrial researchers in battery development and corrosion science. What is the elementary particles or smallest constituent of matter? What is the most fundamental interactions? Uh, these are the questions particle physics try to answer. Quantum chromodynamics, QCD in short, is a theory to describe the dynamics of the strong interaction, which is one of the fundamental forces. We define QCD on a discretized lattice of four-dimensional space-time consisting of the three dimensions of space and one dimension of time and use it to quantitatively examine the 10 to the minus 15th meta world of strong forces using supercomputers. Thanks to recent improvement in algorithms and computer performance, Lattice QCD calculations are entering an era where precision calculation error levels are improving from 10% to 1%. As a result, we can now strive for a new type of physics based on small deviations between experimental values and theoretical calculations. For example, in this figure, we compare the theoretical calculation with error symbols and experimental values with light blue vertical band of a physical parameter called VUS using lattice QCD. Because the discrepancy between the two is evidence of an unknown physical phenomena, it is important to evaluate this discrepancy through further precise calculations in the future. The nucleus on the Earth is a tiny object located at the center of an atom. It is a microscopic object of the femtometer scale, much smaller than the atom, but the weight of all the materials come from nuclear weight, 
Not only the weight, but the energy coming from the sun is produced by a series of nuclear reactions called the PP chain. The nuclear reactions are the energy source of all the stars shining in the sky, and those not nuclear reactions are responsible for the element synthesis in the universe. In fact, there are macroscopic nuclei whose size is about 10 km, known as neutron stars. The neutron star was discovered more than half a century ago, but many of the observed extraordinary phenomena still remain as a mystery. We have been developing a variety of microscopic methods for quantum many-body systems. Using large-scale calculations, we study nuclear structure and reaction, especially properties of collective motion and elementary excitations in nuclei, quantum aspects of nuclear reactions, and non-uniformity structure and response in neutron stars. In our CCS, we have been constructing their unique supercomputer systems and solving various problems under cooperative development by both application and system size of uh, researchers, which is called co-designing nowadays. In the division of high-performance computing systems, we are developing the state-of-the-art supercomputer systems in the architecture design, interconnection, storage, numerical algorithm, and the programming language. One of the recent challenges focuses on the utilization of non-volatile persistent memory, not only for very large capacity memory, but also for extremely high performance of distributed storage systems. We are developing a new file system named CHFS based on this concept. We also have realized the world's first supercomputer equipped with a combination of a GPU and FPGA on each computation node named Cygnus. We think these different devices compensate with each other on their performance characteristics toward complicated physical simulations. The CCES has been developing original high-performance supercomputers and is developing and tuning application programs to maximize performance of the system through the cooperation of researchers in different fields. We are studying the formation and evolution of galaxies, stars, black holes, and the large-scale structure of the universe. A unique feature of our research is that we have developed our own numerical method that accurately captures the propagation of radiation, the interaction of radiation and matter, and the effect of gravity including dark matter, with which we are conducting large-scale simulations using supercomputers. In particular, we have succeeded in accelerating the algorithm of the astrophysical radiative transfer calculation in the algo code using GPUs and FPGAs. These simulations enable us to reproduce the formation of the first stars and galaxies in the early universe. We also use radiation hydrodynamics simulations to study the formation and evolution of galaxies and growth of massive black holes. In the Division of Global Environmental Science, we study urban to global scale weather and climate using various numerical simulation models. Our team uses the supercomputer, an essential tool for applied studies. 
we have developed our own city areas model. This model is one of the world's highest spatial resolution models, which can simulate urban, thermal, wind, and radiation environments and propose the best possible countermeasure to heat stress in cities. We are also working on GPU acceleration of city areas in collaboration with the Division of High Performance Computing Systems. We hope that city areas will become a world standard model and contribute to the research community. The other group has developed the Volcanic Ash Plume Prediction Model Path. Using real-time wind data obtained from the Japan Meteorological Agency, we predict the volcanic ash transported to Tokyo after volcanic events, including a significant explosion of Mount Fuji. After CCS collaborative research across divisions and fields is actively conducted, Especially, we have conducted interdisciplinary collaborations among several divisions. For example, our division works with the astrophysics and HPC divisions for their computational astrobiology research to search the origin of the homochirality of the amino acids. The first principle calculation of them was performed and explained the mechanism on the basis of the cosmic scenario. Our biological function and information growth especially focuses on the phenomena concerning biological molecules such as proteins, lipids, and nucleic acids at the atomic level. The QMMM, molecular dynamics, and docking simulations have been used for clarifying the underlying mechanisms. In the other group, molecular evolution group is studying the evolution of the eukaryote through large-scale molecular phylogenetic analysis. They are focusing on the processes of acquisition and degeneration of intercellular organelles such as mitochondria and chloroplasts. The management and the utilization of big data are significant issues in diverse domains, including computational science. The database group in the Division of Computational Informatics is in charge of research and development in data engineering to utilize big data. Specifically, we have been collaborating with the Division of Global Environmental Science, Division of Particle Physics, and Division of Life Sciences to address the big data problems in the field. Besides, we have been conducting research activities for sleep big data analysis as a part of the Department of Computational Medical Science. In the field of computational informatics, we are promoting advanced research to establish human-friendly computational media for processing human-related information. One of our advanced technology is that field of free viewpoint research that is targeting the environment surrounding our human society. We are passing in the ultimate shape of mixed reality technology to present observation data to humans in a precise and easy to understand style that match the real world. In cooperation with the sport field, so we are making a good collaborative research on performance analysis and skill acquisition using VR technology. We also proceed the international collaboration with a number of top-level institutes over the world and the MOU for high quality of computational science research. We will proceed all our research and promotion activities towards the top-level computational and computer science researches in the world.